Hi there, I'm Flag 6 Chief Meteorologist J.P. Dice. Hope you're having a great Monday. It was a beautiful weekend out there, and it looks like this trend of gorgeous weather is going to continue for a while. Not a lot to talk about in terms of any kind of rain or precipitation. Let's take you through tonight. It is going to be clear, and temperatures, as they have been doing, will drop off fairly rapidly once the sun goes down. 61 degrees, 7 p.m., 58 at 10 o'clock, and 53 degrees at 4 a.m. Clear skies tonight will make for great meteor shower viewing. We have the Orionid meteor shower. That's going to happen during the wee hours of Tuesday morning. That's early tomorrow morning between 2 a.m. and 6 a.m. You could see as many as 25 meteors per hour and the temperatures will be fairly cool. You grab a light jacket, you head out there and look up into the sky. It is going to be fantastic. Let's talk specifics about those temperatures. Down into the lower 50s and upper 40s. You're in Coleman, 48 degrees, 48 Hamilton, and 50 in Talladega. There's a cool front just off to our north and northwest. You can see a few returns on radar ahead of that front. That's not going to get in here. and The rain's not, at least. The cool front, yeah, it's going to make it in here and give us a reinforcing shot of some cooler and drier air. Here's the bottom line. Over the next several days, we're going to be watching the tropics. There's a little bit of development there. You'll see what I'm talking about in a few moments. Chilly mornings. Rain? When's it going to rain? That's a big question we keep getting. GFS forecast model indicating we could see some rain October 29th, October 30th, somewhere in that time period. This afternoon it has felt great, 74 degrees. Notice our dew point temperature right around 48 degrees. Spaghetti plots. I mentioned the tropics. This little area, Bay of Campeche here, we've got highlighted. Models are all over the place. One of the models takes it more toward the east and another one up toward the northern Gulf of Mexico. I'm going to tell you right now, it's too early to say on this when GFS model has an area of low pressure developing over Florida as we get into the next 10 days. So several areas we're watching. Again, I think the, the sea surface temperature and the sun angle is going to be a little bit too low to get a whole lot of anything out of those systems. Tomorrow, our forecast looking good temperatures in the lower to mid 70s, a little warmer off to the west. Tuscaloosa gets up to 78 degrees and no rain in that extended forecast. 74 on Tuesday, 69 Wednesday lower to mid 70s as we get into next week. That's your weather update. Fox 6 Chief Meteorologist J.P. Dice. Weather updates all the time. You can find us right here on Fox 6 News.